Well, for many, Thanksgiving is a time of family celebration and togetherness. But for nearly 2 million senior citizens in New York City who lack access to affordable and nutritious food, the holiday can be a time of loneliness. That is where City Meals on Wheels comes in. The program is on a door to door mission to end elderly food insecurity one meal at a time. Here's how it is. News reporter Michelle Charlesworth. This is all about food and seeing a friendly face. Meals on wheels. Good morning. How are you? Great. We need this, especially over the holidays. The meals on wheels. Okay, thank you. City Meals dates back to 1981, born during the holidays and out of a real need for nutritious food and a few moments of company. Rubem, who is 79 and lives in Midtown, has been enjoying meals for almost five years. It helps me a lot. You know, I live in a very expensive area, and every time I have to go to the supermarket, it's $20, $30. They are very friendly, in including children. Sometimes I see children, it's amazing. They come to do volunteer work. So many meals prepared and delivered. And it was great to hear Rubem talk about how kids show up at his door with the volunteers because this is the most important thing we can teach the next generation. I remember going when I was nine years old with my little sister and brother in Winston-Salem, North Carolina with my granddaddy. Lila Carter, who was a nurse for 27 years, has volunteered doing this for 15 years. It means a lot. It means like, I mean, it's, it's so wonderful. She loves it. it Make me feel good to be able to give back. Right. Doing something to help others. I, some, I, like, I can see myself, you know, in them. Like the, the, um, the old adage that says, there by the grace of God goes I. Beth Shapiro is the CEO of City Meals on Wheels. City Meals is feeding 22,000 older New Yorkers, delivering about 2 million meals a, ne a year. And last year we spent time and engaged with CUNY's Urban Food Policy Institute and found that the majority of the people we're feeding actually need more food than what they're getting. I really appreciate all of that, all the help. Thank you so much. You're welcome. The average price of a meal is 75 cents and all money from the general public goes straight to the program. In Midtown, Michelle Charlesworth, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.